Hey there, it's Susie from Teaching Tech Academy. And in this video, I'm going to show you how to install LearnDash, which is a very popular learning management system used in WordPress. Now, this video is part of a much bigger course, and you can find it on our website at teachingtechacademy.com or hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell to be notified when I add more lessons to this YouTube channel. So if you're ready, let's get going. Welcome back, course creators. In this video, we are going to install our learning management system, otherwise known as an LMS. And for our purposes, we are going to be installing LearnDash. Now, there are a few of them out there. Uh, LearnDash, there's Lifter. I really happen to like LearnDash. It's just a personal preference. I think it's easy to use, and I think it looks nice, okay? So let's go ahead and install LearnDash. So in order to do that, LearnDash is a plugin, okay? So it's not a theme. A theme affects how our site, the overall site, how it looks, how our menu looks, how the logo, the colors, et cetera, et cetera. Okay, what a plugin does, it adds extra functionality to your site. For instance, you can add a, um, a calendar to your site. You can add something like um, an event registration plugin to your site. These all add additional functionality to your site. So um, yeah, so what we're gonna do is we are in our dashboard. I'm just gonna go over here, so our dashboard. And we're gonna scroll down on the left-hand side to where it says plugins. Okay, we can either go to install plugins or add new. Let's just go to add new. Great, so here's where we can add a bunch, a bunch of WordPress plugins. And there are many, many plugins out there. All you have to do is Google them. I mean, honestly, you can have a plugin built for <laughs> anything you need to have done. But cautionary story, do not overload your website with a bunch of frivolous plugins because then they start fighting for each other for speed and you know taking up space and bleh, becomes a mess. <laughs> Okay, so let's go and install LearnDash. So in order to do that, we're gonna we've we've we were in plugins, add new, and search plugins. I'm gonna say Learn Dash and hit enter. Okay, so let's go ahead and install uh, our plugin. Now, the first thing we need to do is we need to actually go and download the LearnDash plugin from its own site. And we can find that here. by going to learndash.com. Okay, now I suggest that when you have a free moment, just go through and just read over this website. It is really impressive. And I want you guys to understand what it is you're actually using because it just makes you more knowledgeable in how your course is run, okay? So you don't have to go into the nitty gritty because I will do that for you. And you can definitely go down a deep rabbit hole learning all this stuff. So take some time when you have a moment and go on learndash.com and read it. In the meantime, I'd like you to go over into the pricing. Now, LearnDash is an awesome plugin, like I said, but it does come um, at a price. And obviously, the more you pay, the more functionality you get. So, for our purposes, we are going to want the basic 
okay? Now, currently right now, uh, this is in the post-holiday season or in the holiday season, so they've been running specials. Uh, depending on when you're watching this, this may uh, increase to its normal price. I've seen it at this price. Um, it's now the end of December. I've seen it since, uh, really since Cyber Monday, so about uh, six weeks. Okay, so you need it for one site. You have unlimited courses, so you can upload as many courses as you want onto LearnDash and have your whole course store door, which is amazing. Again, I'm getting ahead of myself because they get so excited. Um, it has drip feed lessons, quizzes, badges, for you name it. Okay. It's awesome. Now there is a 30 day money back guarantee and I do believe it is on a, well, I know they make you pay uh, for a year up front, which is $159. But when you think about that, let's quickly pull this up. 159 divided by 12, you're looking at $13.25 per month for an amazing piece of technology. Okay, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna add it to your cart. You are gonna fill out all of your information and submit your order, okay? Now, I have already purchased this, so I'm gonna show you, it's, I think it's, I believe it's in my download file, and that's where it should be for you. You should probably have an email. Um, I'm going to jump over to my download file and show you exactly where it gets located once you, once you purchase it, okay? Hold on a minute, folks. Okay, so once you complete your purchase of the LearnDash plugin, you're gonna get a couple of different emails. Obviously, you're gonna get an invoice um, that says that you've paid it. You're also gonna get um, an email talking about your temporary password. Typically, your email will be your username and they'll give you a temporary password. And of course, you can always edit that once you log in for the first time. So I have logged in, uh, to, I just went to Learn Dash main page and then over on the right-hand column, right-hand side, you'll see a login uh, link. So you log in and now I've come to my downloads, okay? Now I have a couple versions of it. Um, so basically, you probably don't have the Pro, you probably just have this one. So what you're going to do is you're going to want to download this, okay? All right, so when you download this, we are going to then jump back to our WordPress site and upload it, okay? So let's do that now. So what I'm going to do is we are in Plugins, Add New, and I want to upload plugin, okay? So now it says if you have a plugin in a .zip format, you can install it by uploading it here. So you, your download should have been in a .zip format. So what we're gonna do is we are going to choose a file, navigate to where it is, okay? I believe mine is in the downloads file. So I navigated to my downloads file and chose the uh, .zip file for the Learn Dash, okay? And now we're gonna say install now. It could take a few minutes. Okay, so this says that it failed, and then the reason it failed is because I've already installed this, but yours should say plug in successful and then activate it, okay? I'm just gonna go back to my installed plugins and reactivate the Learn Dash, okay? So here I am. See, I have to activate it. And here we go, Learn Dash LMS. So I'm just gonna, for me, I'm just gonna simply activate it. You, of course, will have it successfully installed and then you'll hit the activate button, okay? And while I'm at it, I'm just gonna activate my Astro Pro account. Actually, no, I'm not. I'm gonna deactivate that because I wanna show you the difference. Okay, and that's a special thing, okay? That's, let's not get confused in that. Fantastic, okay, you just installed your first plugin. So what is a plugin? A plugin adds functionality. It's like a mini piece of software, okay? It adds different functionality to your site. Again, it could be from anything from a portfolio uh, uh, carousel to, um, you know, a Calendly, uh, being able to um, set an appointment or whatever, um, checking in registration events, things like that. I mean, there's tons of it out there. Okay, so that's what a plugin is. And what you just did is you installed the Learn Dash LMS plugin because that is 
the piece of software that we, allows us to create courses and within courses create lessons. And by I mean by it, what I mean is like we create courses and lessons. They're not writing it for us. They're just giving us a wonderful framework and where to add our content. Okay. Alrighty, and let's jump over to the next video.